I don't want to, you know, go to jail in a few years. I don't, I don't want to get in trouble. I don't want to be on timeout. I don't want my video games taken away from me. So I did the right thing and just sat at home and, you know, started playing games and killing time and, you know, just chilling in my room by myself for years and years to come. How was it? How was your childhood, man? What were like the ups and downs of your childhood? I'm going to tell you, I thought my childhood was great until I got onto a podcast with two idiots and they told me, we know you were with the babysitter 24-7 while your parents were gone. And I talk about these baby mamas all the time and I realized my mom gave me the baby mama experience. You know what I'm saying? They were like 30 while I was like five, six, seven, eight. And they were going out to New York and going to the club or they were going on vacation. They still thought they were young. And I was at an age where I remember I was left at home. I, was, I know one time where I pissed my bed and told them I'll keep pissing my bed if they leave tonight to go to DR or whatever it may be. And I was like, you know what I'm saying? It's those days that give me that, you know, that lonely road, that, that maturity, that, that growing up. And so I grew up at a younger age. My brother took it the wrong way. You know, he used to sneak out. He used to do drugs. He used to, and we were like 12, 13, you know what I'm saying, acting up. And I just took everything that he did as a mistake, and I took it into consideration. I was like, 